Hey guys, I'm Veronica Hill with California Travel Tips and today we're traveling along historic Route 66 for a peek inside the Wigwam Motel. The San Bernardino Wigwam Motel is one of three remaining in the nation and the only one in California. It's located 55 miles east of Los Angeles and 72 miles from the route's ending point at Santa Monica Pier. The Wigwam Motel is actually started by a man named Frank Redford. He was born in 1880. He built his first one in the uh, 1920s in Kentucky. It grew to a large chain of seven of them, which this became number seven. Him and his wife retired here. And this was built along Route 66. There's only two that he built on Route 66. And it's part of uh, Route 66's Roadside America you know, history. Okay guys, so now Kumar is going to show us around the Wigwam property. Let's go check it out. Well, I'm going to show you guys a room inside of a room. Hopefully there's no one in this room. I've been known to make mistakes sometimes. Ha, <laughs> happens. Go on in. I'm trying the lights. You can come on in and take a look around. I'll tell you a little bit. The Wigwam Motels were built in the early 40s, or sorry, the late 40s, early 50s. Uh, we put different furniture in here just to kind of make it more easy for guests to be accommodated. Uh, the bathroom still has the original tile work they did in 1949, which is pretty neat. So you got the original tile. Um, we try to clean up around it and keep it maintained. Um, something you'll notice in the bathroom, there's no electrical outlets. Some people always complain because they don't have it back in the 50s and they didn't have that requirement. People didn't need that. So they didn't build bathrooms with that type of plugs. So I get people plugging in here, blow drying their hair, whatnot. But it's a fun, neat thing of staying here. It's pretty cool, yeah. We heard about that and said, you gotta stay at the Wigwams because that's a kind of a unique experience, yeah. you know? And it really is. Yeah. 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 So we woke up on a reservation. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of things about the Wigwam Hotel. There's 19 teepees room-wise. There's a lobby teepee. And then you actually have the foundation back here. At one point, they're gonna use the whole lot in the back to build more uh, structures, but they stopped in the 50s. I think it's financial reasons. They just couldn't afford to build more. And it worked out because it's cozy with the amount I have, and it, and it looks nice, you know, it's all laid out perfect. Now, some days I wish I had 100 of them, and some days I wish I only had two. But what can you do, right? That's the way life is. These cars are donated to us. A lot of people, if you travel Route 66, you'll see a lot of places with old cars and things out front. It just kind of shows the old, you know, people traveling the old roads and stuff like that. You know, the old John Steinbeck, you know, Grapes of Wrath type of thing, you know, all the old Okies, you know, moving west, you know, to find a better life after the Dust Bowls, sort of like that. You know, the reason why they call it the Mother Road is because it gave birth to new opportunities, you know. And that's what it is, Main Street America. They figured out how to connect all the roads, so they connected all these little towns to Main Street. So if you drive Route 66, lo and behold, you will drive through basically the main town in the, some of the old town, the main streets of the, that town. And that's what's really, really neat about it. We don't know when the pool was added, but I know from structure-wise, it's being a kidney shape, go inside, that it could have been added in the 60s or the 70s. Obviously, ice machine is still a quarter. <laughs> One of the greatest things to ever happen is John Lasseter from the Pixar um, made the movie, the Cars movie, and it has changed the way the world has seen Route 66. From that, uh, people have came out from everywhere, television shows, magazines, you name it. And we hope the future Route 66 survives and grows as a part of uh, our American heritage. Um, even the National Park Services are taking part of this. They want to see the, the road survive. Thanks for joining us at the historic Wigwam Motel. If you have a suggestion on where we should go next, drop us a line in the comments below. And please don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching. Click subscribe and you'll get new California videos delivered to you every Friday, just in time for the weekend.